Apostolic Christian Assembly, Perambu Ministries welcomes you for Thought for the Night Devotion. God bless you as you prayerfully listen to this brief devotion. Warm greetings to you this evening in the unchanging name of our Lord and Saviour, Jesus Christ. You all have things we are believing for. We are standing in faith, waiting for it to happen. We don't see any good signs of things happening. We need to believe that the Lord is faithful to answer that which we are prayed for. Unmindful of the situation that you are facing in life, God wants you to believe that He is a faithful God. For the Bible says, the one who has called us is faithful. For our devotion this evening, let us read Mark chapter 11 and verse 24. The words of Jesus Christ, Whatsoever you ask for when you pray, believe that you have received it and you will have it. He said, believe that you will receive it when you pray. But we need to have faith to believe that whatever we have asked of God, God is faithful to bring it to pass. We need to realize that once we have asked God for something, we need to believe that we have received it. Start thanking God for what you have asked of Him. That's really showing your trust and faith in God. The Bible says in 1 John chapter 5, verses 14-15, to 15, This is the confidence we have in God, that if we ask anything according to His will, He hears us, and we know that He will give us whatever we ask of Him. You need to have this confidence this evening that if we ask anything according to the will of God, you can be assured that He will answer you. You don't have to doubt whether God will do it for me, but you have to have the faith that God will give it to us. He is a Heavenly Father and we have the assurance that whatever we ask of Him, He will give it to us. As parents, we are so careful to meet the needs of our children how much more a heavenly father will meet every need that we ask of him. But you got to have the faith to believe. Never doubt God. Things may not happen according to your timetable, but believe that God will bring it to pass in this perfect timing. Don't cancel out your prayer with negative talk. You can't pray for victory and talk defeat. Even you believe that you have received whatever you have asked for, thus having faith in an ever-faithful God. This is the confidence that we have in our God because He is an El Shaddai God a God of more than enough. He is called Jehovah Jireh, the Lord God, our provider. He is called Jehovah Rapha, the Lord God, our healer, the great I am, the all-sufficient one. When we ask in faith, we can be assured that God is going to bring it to pass in our life. Now adore God's faithfulness. The Bible says in James chapter 1, verses 6 to 8, But let him ask in faith, nothing wavering. For he that wavereth is like a wave of the sea, driven with the wind and tossed. For let not that man think that he shall receive anything of the Lord. A double-minded man is unstable in all his ways. Have faith in God this evening because God is faithful to answer you and to meet every need of yours. If God doesn't care for us, who else will care for us? So you can be assured this evening because God loves us. We are precious in the sight of God. But God this evening wants us to take him at his word. Never doubt the word of God. Whatever you have asked of God, believe that you have the assurance that God will answer your prayer. Never waver. Never doubt God. Put doubt in your heart. You can never experience the blessing of God in your life. The plan of the enemy is to put doubt in your mind. Will God do it? But you got to overcome those thoughts by saying, I know my God can. My God will take care of every need in my life. I know my God is a faithful God. Start believing God for the impossible things in life. And you will experience God doing wonderful things in your life. Whatever you need may be in life, believe that God is faithful to take care of every need in your life. We are a people that don't walk by sight, but we live by faith. Right now, things may not be happening according to what you desire, but you have prayed for it. Believe that God is faithful to change every situation. He is able to pull down every Jericho wall, open up the Red Sea, and make a way for you. Commit your life to God and believe that God is faithful to accomplish everything that you have asked for Him because you have asked it in the all-powerful, unchanging, ever-faithful name of Jesus Christ. Think of the life of Anna. She came into God's presence with a need. She poured for her heart before God and she believed that whatever she had asked the Lord, God was faithful to answer her prayer. The Bible says she left God's presence and her countenance was no more the same. In other words, she had the faith to believe 
that God was faithful to answer her prayer. And God did answer her prayer. The Bible says that God remembered Hannah and God granted her the desires of her heart. Dear child of God, I don't know what your need may be this evening, but you need to remember that the Lord God who has created you knows everything concerning you. You need to have the faith to believe that God is faithful to answer every prayer that you have asked of Him. Commit your life to God this evening. Put your faith and trust in another faithful God. With no shadow of doubt, believe that God can do great and mighty things for you, through you, and in you. May God bless you, and may God be with you. Amen.